This place is for everyone and anyone. Hello. Come in. Um, welcome to Pitt Street Skate Park, an undercover skate, skate park project. I'm going to give you a little walk around so you understand the concept behind what we're going to do with phase one of the project. As you walk here on the left, this is going to be the big shop front. We're going to have a big counter that leads all the way around here, all the way to the front. General back offices, that's where you'll be able to rent roller boots, etc. Then here, we're going to have some turnstiles. If we go back on ourselves a little bit, welcome to the canteen. This is where you'll come get some food, coffee, whatever you want. Um, the reason I said about the turnstiles before is because we're going to have, like it's going to be kind of caged off here, so the general public can come and spectate and not worry about having to pay and just grab a coffee, because this is where the skate park's going to be. Look at that space. You know, there's so much more scope to this place than just a skate park. It's the creative community hub. A large part of that will come into phase two, which is upstairs, but we'll talk about that later. But right now, there'll be different sessions, mixed sessions, you know, beginners, over 40s, whatever, you know, if people want to get in and learn, they come in and give it a go. We've got Portsmouth Skate Academy that runs under this roof. So at the moment it's skateboarding, but we hope to expand because we know a lot of professionals in all genres and all fields of wheeled sports. But aside from that, we want workshops, we're gonna have big events, competitions, you name it, we'll do it here. Rain or shine. This is where we're gonna have sort of like a chill out room. We're gonna have lockers on the walls, um, pool table, air hockey, you know, somewhere where you can just hang out with your friends, watch old skateboard videos on the wall. We're gonna have a separate half pipe room. Well, it's gonna be a mini ramp, they call it a mini ramp, but it's gonna be pretty big because the ceiling's a bit higher, although we're gonna look at uh, maybe heighten in that ceiling in that room, but that's something we're going to look at later. Um, this space in here, quick peek. I think it's going to be a games room. Maybe get old pinball, time crisis, you know. All the old classics. This place is for everyone and anyone that wants to give it a go. If they've done it when they were younger and haven't done it, they've never done it. Anyone's welcome. You know, if we can accommodate you, we will. And I highly recommend it, giving it a go because it's good for you. You meet new people and it's good for your soul. It makes you feel good. This is gonna be the other part of the skate park. This is where we'll have the roller discos, but it'll be a multifunctional space. So, you know, if people wanna come and do other things, long boarding, if they just wanna use flat ground, but also we wanna have break dancing clubs. There's so much scope to this space. The real serious point about all of this is, you know, these things do cost quite a lot of money. Um, we're working really, really hard just trying to find other pots, but, you know, it's quite a gargantuan project. So the more little pots we can put together, we can gain the big pot. We've got a lot of awesome rewards to give away. So if you have a little look at the list on the bottom afterwards, there's loads of ways you guys can get involved and help us achieve our goal. We're doing something that's never happened in this city before. We are actually making history. And wouldn't it be nice if you could help make a bit of that history, hey?